guys. Today we're reviewing the Butterball Indoor Electric Turkey Fryer XL. This thing can safely fry up to a 20 pound turkey. Here it is out of the box. So unboxing it was nice. It comes uh, packaged up really well so you don't have to worry about parts getting broken or dented or you know worrying about opening a box that's going to be damaged. Anyways let's look at this thing starts out here with this lid kind of a flimsy construction a little wiggly it's just really stamped metal here flip that thing open like that and it rests in the open position and then inside you can see that we have this thing to uh, pull out uh, from the handle you can raise the basket the magnetic plug which is attached to this thing as you can see just get that right here. This is the handle for the basket. Lift that right out. And then you can see the heating element right here. This uh, big black dish is also removable by first removing the element. And then you can just grab it with two hands and lift it out. This unit really has one nice feature and that's the drain. Uh, you can see right here that the drain has a knob as well as a uh, cap that you can screw on and off. And then we would turn it uh, to the open position and then the oil would begin to flow out. But they provide you with this really nice spigot here. It makes draining this thing a snap. You just screw this on and then you can hold your jugs right underneath. All right, here's the control unit. It has uh, the thermometer, thermostat, that you would set all the way here for frying, and then off, you can hear it click. Uh, the ready light, and then the power light. Up here is a digital timer, it's two digits. You can set this, and it just beeps once it reaches the 55 minute countdown or whatever you set for it. The basket has a very nice feature because you can hang the basket right here on the edge once you're done frying and the turkey will drain into the pan and then you have these things in case you noticed right here on the edges here this just collects condensation or oil uh, that just forms during the frying process our power outlet like I said earlier is uh, magnetic so all you have to do is plug it in and then stick it in there and it'll sit right there and then you can pull it out, not a problem. So if somebody were to walk by and trip on the cord, then it wouldn't just yank the fryer down. Uh, the instructions say not to use an extension cord because you'll lose current, that'll increase your cooking time. Uh, and unfortunately, the cord is about three feet long. Uh, so that may pose a problem depending on where you set this up. They say it's an indoor fryer, but I don't know about whether or not you'd wanna do it inside because Frying oil really stinks up the house, uh, but it is safe. There's no flame or anything, and as long as you follow the instructions and your turkey is dry and uh, room temperature, you shouldn't have a problem. Well, that's all I can think about to talk about this unit, so if you have any questions, just ping me in the comments.